it is Jana from the Bath Township Public Library, and I am Zach with me. Hello, everybody, and the Holy Guy World. Today, we are going to be making our June craft to go. We are making paper and popsicle stick birdhouses. Right? So, when you pick up your bag from the Bath Township Public Library, should we open it up? Yes. We you, have this. You are going to have a poster board, birdhouse. Um, three popsicle sticks. Oh, yeah, we'll have that too. You will have, probably well, we have a bomb. You will have your little bird. A ribbon. A ribbon. Three popsicle sticks. And a black piece of construction paper. You have your construction paper? Okay. In addition to the things from your bag, you are going to need scissors, glue stick, something to color with. And a black choppy. Yeah, you can use a pen. That might be a, um, a black Sharpie pen or a fine tip marker. Will be easier to maybe draw the legs of your birds and do any writing on it. Um, also, you can use some tape to secure your ribbon. That is a little bit easier, but you can also glue it. So when we get started, we are going to take our birdhouse shape. Do you know what the shape is? At the card. Not a hexagon close. This is one, two, three, four, five sides. It is a pentagon. Hexagon has six sides. So this is going to be your birdhouse. So first thing we're going to do is... Color you, it. You're right. We are going to color our birdhouse. So you can color it however you want it. You're going to color yours green. Oh, it's gold. Gold. So let's see, what color do I want my birdhouse to be? I think I'm going to make mine this pinkish red here. Same. Oh, very cool. We picked the same color. Now, you can do designs on it. You can just make it all solid. You can color it however you want. Are you going to draw some flowers on yours? Oh, very nice. That's what? Just one flower? Okay. That's all right. I think I'm gonna and I have it. peach flower petals. Pink flower petals. So peach. Peach flower petals. Very nice. I think I'm going to do mine with some stripes. So you can make it however you want. That's right. Get creative. It can be striped, polka dotted. Fakey. As you can see, the one my daughter did has cute little flower designs on it. She's a much better artist than I am. Okay. And they also get something I can say. Home T Home. It says home tweet home. That's right. It's a pun. Instead of home sweet home, it says home tweet home. Because it's a birdhouse and birds say tweet, 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 tweet. Both of me say home tweet home. We can write home tweet home on it. Once you're done coloring your birdhouse, you can go ahead and color your bird. So, nope, now we're going to color our bird. Forever. Yep, we're going to do that after we color our bird. So first, color your bird. I think I'm going to have a blue bird. What color is your bird going to be? Gold. Gold. Very nice. I am a gold bird. A gold bird. Wait, gold. Can the wing be a different color? The wings can be a different color. You can. Lots of birds have lots of colors on them. You can color your bird however you want. It is your bird. My wings have crisps. Ooh, very nice. Blue and gold stripes. And it's okay if you go out of the lines a little bit because we're going to cut them out, right? Yeah. And I'm going to give him a little orange. Can you give me your own that? There you go. Ooh, I like it. Oh, there's my bird. Oh, I like your bird. All right, now we are going to cut the bird out. 
Okay. It may go back to down. That's okay. He is tiny, so if you need help cutting out your bird, it's okay to ask a grown-up for help. Because he is a tiny thing, and sometimes it's hard to cut out, especially he's got little feathers on top of his head and his tiny little beak. Do you need help? Okay. That's all right. Wait a second. My bird, cut out. No, we're gonna draw the legs on once he's on the house. It'll make it a little bit easier. All right. Once your bird is cut out, you're gonna take your black scrap. I cut that bird. Yep, we're gonna cut out the little hole for your bird house for your bird to go into his house. So you can trace something, or you can just kind of eyeball a hole. It doesn't have to be perfect. So once you have your circle cut out. Glue it on. Yes, we are going to glue the circle on a full glue to our birdhouse. And you can have lots of little details. Yeah. All right, so now. I got the bag at the top. Now, nope, you want it down towards the center, like towards the bottom of the center. See? So, like, put below your words. There you go. So, here's the hole for our little bird to go in. Hmm. What are you drawing coming out of the hole? I make it all look like a big eyeball. Mmm. Weird. Okay. Once we're done with that part, we'll go we are grab the popsicle kit. Yes, we're gonna take our popsicle sticks and glue them on. All right. So wait. So you have three popsicle sticks. Take your glue stick, and we're gonna spread some glue along the top edge of the pentagon. Top edges of the pentagon, which are the roof of your popsicle stick. So you're gonna glue on each side. Okay. I'm gluing my roof last. You're gonna do the roof last. You're doing the bottom part. So there's the roof. Oh. Uh oh. Now we're gonna glue one along the bottom. Good job. Put one along the bottom there. And then you say, whole tree hole. Now, you're going to say, whole tree hole. Now we are going to glue our bird on. So I'm going to glue him kind of right there. I'm going to glue mine. Where am I? Okay, so we're going to glue my our bird is. Right kind of in front of his little door. And this is where if you have a Sharpie, you can take your Sharpie and you can just draw him. It's a little bit easier with a finer tip pen. Just draw him some little legs. There, now he has some little legs. Oop, I got lots of glue strings hanging off here. You draw your bird some little legs. So he's kind of standing on the, the edge of his bird house. Your bird has four legs. <laughs> that is a crazy looking bird. All right. Oh my goodness. He's like a cross between a bird and a caterpillar. All right, just want to let it sit for a little bit so the popsicle sticks dry. Now, once that part's done. It's like this. Oh, okay, we're switching. All right, so once that part's done, you're going to take your ribbon. And this is where I say you can use tape. You could also glue it, it's just going to take longer to dry. Put our glue stick caps on. We want to make sure we have our caps back on our glue sticks. Yes, while they don't fly out. That's right. So, real easy. Here. No, so I want. Okay, you're going to make the tape off. So, you're just going to take a piece of tape. Whoa! And take the ends of your ribbon to the back of your birdhouse, just like that. That way you have a nice loop and you can hang it up. And it's a really nice little decoration that you can hang up in your house. <laughs> There's our paper birdhouses. So be sure to pick up your June craft to go kit from the circulation desk at the Bath Township Public Library right. and you can make your own birdhouse. That we quit that. Oh, now we're gonna switch back, okay.
<laughs> Thank you for watching. Bye, everybody. Go back. Mm-hmm.